We all know what rockets are, and we all have an idea of how rockets work. Rockets expel exhaust away from the direction of acceleration, so as a result of the conservation of momentum and Newton's third law, the rocket accelerates. There is, however, a factor that makes the motion of a rocket a complicated system. While a rocket gains momentum by expelling matter to the direction, it is also losing momentum by losing its mass. When early rocket scientists are attempting to formulate an equation that could describe the motion of a rocket, which is then a concept popular in imagining future space travel, the equation that was formulated was named the Tsiolkovsky Rocket Equation, attributed to Russian early rocket scientist Konstantin Tsiolkovsky, who discovered the equation independently in 1903. The derivation process involves differential and integral calculus, which is shown here. Pause the video if you want to study it carefully. Anyways, the basic principle behind the equation is that a rocket is losing mass from the exhaust while gaining velocity, and the change in velocity of the rocket depends on the mass of the fuel, the mass of the rocket, and the velocity that the exhaust is expelled at. Since this rocket equation does not consider the effect of other external forces, such as gravity or air resistance acting on the rocket, and also doesn't apply for multi-stage rockets, the Tsiolkovsky rocket equation is also being referred to as the ideal rocket equation. Ideal situations where the rocket's motion exactly corresponds to that described by the equation is very rare, almost non-existent due to so many acting forces in our universe. However, the ideal rocket equation can be modified to mathematical expressions that considers other forces, or considers rocket staging. Therefore, due to its adaptability and practical link to real-world rockets, the Tsiolkovsky rocket equation is now being widely adapted and applied by astronautics and engineers around the world for ground-based rocket launches and satellite rocket engines in orbital maneuvers. However, as alternative tools of transportation such as space elevators and tethers may become more popular in the future, the Tsiolkovsky equation will eventually fall out of applicability. The calculator linked in the description allows users to input basic parameters of a rocket to obtain the rocket's change in velocity in a specific period of time. The calculator outputs two values, the change in velocity of the rocket with and without the consideration of gravity. 